you know, centaurs. I've been thinking about them ever since I watched a YouTube short from Thor or Pirate Software about how they have two rib cages. And I'm trying to come up with parts of their anatomy, trying to use science or more accurately what little knowledge I actually have about the anatomy of humans or horses. And the first results on Google whenever I'm Googling things. I'm just going to say my thoughts in a shitty list form. No real connection with each other or segues. This video I'm making very tired. I'm sure you can hear. Let's begin with the heart. Obviously, the heart of a centaur would have to be big, as big as a horse's, though I do think it'd be bigger since I think the human torso and arms and head would be bigger than a horse's head. And I do think the heart would be in the horse body rather than the human body. I don't want to... We're moving on to the next topic, by the way. I don't really want to think about it, but like a center spine would have to suddenly go to the 90 degree angle. And that's just kind of fucked up, right? <laughs> There's no really thought about it. Uh, no expansion on that thought. That, it's just disturbing to me. There's a, something would also have to hold it up, hold up the human body from flopping forward or backwards. And I don't really like thinking about that, so let's move on to the next topic. <laughs> Let's move on to their intelligence, or more accurately, their brain-to-body mass ratio. If the brain-body mass ratio actually does indicate intelligence, I'm not actually sure if it does, that's just a hypothesis rather than theory, a center would generally be less intelligent than a regular human due to the brain mass being smaller ratio-wise than a human's. Uh, next topic their lungs i think this this there's no real like thought there's no thoughts behind any of this but like i think the lungs would just be like really fucking long in the human torso and expand to the horse's front i don't know that's that's actually just kind of funny and i mean the theory the idea was in my mind is either they have really long lungs or like two sets of lungs one in the human body and one in the horse body but i i just kind of like thinking they have like really long lungs <laughs> maybe it was from that one meme i saw a while back about the <laughs> shitty ad about uh, i'll expand your lungs <laughs> i don't know i don't know a lot of things anyway uh i think the entire human torso part of the body would be <laughs> those giant fucking lungs I was thinking, talking about earlier. And the horses, everything else would be in the horse body. Because the lungs take up a lot of space. Even horse-sized lungs. I'm not actually sure how long, big horse-sized lungs are compared to like human-sized lungs. But they're, they're, they're still pretty big. At least according to the anatomy chart I saw. And I think that, that uh, amount of space being saved purely by moving the lungs to the human body would allow everything else just to fit in the horse body. This is a stupid fucking video. <laughs> this is a really fucking stupid video. And this is the end of my thoughts about the, this. Anyway, have, have a good one, yeah?